Hey everybody, how you doing? Cave Dweller 1959 coming at you from the cave. Got a little news for you. Just doing a follow-up video on one I did a couple weeks ago, if you remember. Uh, I checked my YouTube before going to work one day and there was a whole bunch of these uh, not acceptable for most advertisers on lots and lots and lots of my videos. Wow, what the heck's that about? Come home after work and it's all gone. It's all back. Said something really, really fishy's going down here. Well, it's going down. Tell you what's happening. Uh, three of my videos from almost a year ago, casting bullets. Uh, first, they pulled one, completely gone. Uh, you got a cautionary, a warning strike against me. Well, okay, what the hell's that, you know? That was about two weeks ago, uh, a little over a week ago, right out of a week, whatever ago. Uh, they pulled two more of them. I started looking at this, like, what the hell, you know? And I posted them there, fine and dandy. When you look at the stuff, what's allowed, what's not, every time you post a video, if it's monetizable or not, they were. But if you go into the post where now I'm uh, got strikes against me, you click on that, what's going on, and you go into the lawyer speak, the 38 pages of BS. Uh, on what I was reading, it says you cannot advocate the sale of ammo, right? I can't say, hey, look at this, I sell this stuff, send me a PM, I'll sell it to you. Or advocate, you go down to Billy Bob's gun shop, and they got the best ammo. No, you can't do that. That's not what I was doing. Casting lead bullets, powder coating them. Well, you go into that 38 page of lawyer speak, and it's down there says you cannot manufacture ammo. Two different complete things on the same YouTube. Anyway, I've been in YouTube jail for a little over a week now. I'm going to post this as soon as it's up. Uh, also, I haven't put a lot of videos out in December. Not a lot going on in my life. There ain't a lot of hunting going on. My daily income's going straight down, and what in the heck is going on? So I go back and start looking. Dozens and dozens and dozens and dozens of videos going back all the way seven years of being on YouTube are being not suitable for most advertisers. They demonetized them. I got videos out there six, seven years old, still make a buck or two a month, you know, a buck or two a month. Not much, but when you got 360 videos on there, a buck or two a month off a whole bunch of them adds up. Well, they ain't adding up no more. So it's time to do it. Uh, I jumped on, I started up a account, a channel on Rumble. I took off my, a lot of my old stuff from Patreon, the first stuff, you know, I got about 100, 120, 110, 130, depending, you know, some come, some go, members over there. So a lot of that content has never been seen by 99.9%. .9%. And I'm putting it over on Rumble just to see if I can build a following. Uh, put a link at the bottom. I appreciate it. Go over there. Nothing more. Just click the subscribe button. Uh, see if I can get something going. That said, YouTube does have a really, really good, well-run platform for a creator. You can go in and check virtually anything. Rumble, uh, to me it looks like they're set up for uh, just example, huge news organizations. You wanna, you work a late shift or something, you don't get to see the Dan Bongino show. You can go home, rumble, watch the Dan Bongino show. It's on there all the time. Uh, not set up for a small time guy. So man, watch that video one time, never come back and watch it again. So everything you put on there, you better get it in the first three, two, three days. It's gone. <clears throat> Another thing, excuse me, comments. On YouTube, somebody comments on videos, whether they're uh, uh, yesterday's video or two, three, four, five years old, I get a deal right there on the comments. In order, they came in every comment that's ever made on any of them. Rumble doesn't have that. I get an email said, hey, so-so commented on this video. When you go on Rumble, there is no place to track. There's not there. They are made for, I'm gonna say, big news corporations or big whatever. They're gonna put the show on it. People are gonna watch it one time Oh, they might comment on it, but there'll never be any um, communication. Say, I do a betting job, and somebody comes back and says, Hey, why exactly did you do that part? Well, I click on comments like I can answer the guy back. That conversation might go. You've seen some. I've had some on there. There's 30, 40, 50, 60, back, forth, back, forth, back, forth, blah, 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 blah. Anyway, folks, I'm over on Rumble. I'm trying to get it going. Thanks a lot. I've been babbling, rambling on here longer than I should. Thanks a lot. I'm going to start getting in. I'm going to do a video right here, right now. It'll be the next one up after this one. Thanks a lot. Click on Rumble. 
hit that subscribe. Cave Dollar out.